Praise God, everybody. Ty Tribbett here. Not on behalf of myself, but representing the kingdom of God, being an ambassador for Christ. want to just send uh, a note of concern and, and comfort and condolences to the people who suffered major loss over in China over the severe earthquake. Though the Bible does speak of earthquakes in diverse places, you know, in the end, that's a sign of the end of the, end of time. It's a sign that His coming is near, that there will be earthquakes in diverse places. Though that's the sign of the times, and though that's proving the Bible to be true, you still can't deny the effect it's having on the community and the society in, in China. So we just wanted to come on here and just uh, send our condolences, send our concerns, and let you know that uh, you know that God cares and God has a plan and He knows what He's doing. All the time, it's not easy to just swallow that and say, okay, I understand, I trust God, because it's challenging sometimes to trust God, especially when things dear to you are lost. Uh, I know they're still looking for people from what we hear, and uh, we just want you to know our prayers are with you, and our heart is with you, and just through it all, just understand that God does not make mistakes. Understand that you have no other choice but to trust Him at this point. Uh, uh, when, when stuff is shaking up in our lives, not just literally, but even turbulence on the airplane, when it's shaking, we always try to grab for something solid. When your world shakes up, you grab for something solid. Like, what's solid? You're not going to grab a fork, a knife, a cup. You're going to look for something that's grounded and that's stable and that's not moving. Well, now, not just your world, but there's a lot of people whose world is shook up right now and that's been shaking. And now's the time for you to grab that solid thing. There's an old song that says, On Christ, the solid rock I stand, all of the grounds are sinking sand. Jesus Christ is the only solid thing that we can grab a hold to now in a world where your mind is confused, your thoughts and your emotions are in an in a uproar. A uproar. Now's the time to really cling to Christ and grab a hold of Him, and He'll help you through these difficult times. Let me pray with you. Father, I just thank you for everyone who took the time to just listen to this, and we pray, God, for those that are in China that are suffering, that may have some family members under the rubble. I'll, I don't know that feeling. I'll never know that feeling, Father. But I do know you are the God of, 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 of comfort in tragedy. You are the God of comfort in tragedy. You've proven yourself to be that in my life. Now prove yourself to those beautiful people in China. They are souls as well, Father. Comfort their hearts now and give them peace that passive all understanding. Let them not even understand why they have peace, but it's the comfort of Jesus Christ. Father, we lean and we depend on you. Matter of fact, in all our ways, we acknowledge you. Father, for those, we just intercede for those in China now. No, it wasn't an earthquake near my house, but it was an earthquake there. We intercede for them now, God. Just give them strength. Give them, give them, give them comfort. Give them peace, God, in the name of Jesus. And turn their hearts to you. Turn their hearts to you. Let none of them go crazy. Let none of them lose hope. Let none of them lose faith, God. But let them gain trust. Let them do this gain hope in you. Paul says, I glory in tribulations. I glory in persecution and necessities. He calls tribulations necessities. Because in our weakness, his strength is made perfect. So, Father, make their, make their uh, strength, make your strength perfect in their weakness now, Father. And prove yourself to be the true and living God, even in China. In Jesus' name, amen. God bless you, everybody. Be blessed. Look to the hills from whence cometh your help. The tragedy is not the end. For better is the ending of a thing than the beginning. God bless you. Our heart goes out to you. And our prayers will forever be with you. God bless.